Hi friends and Vanna fans, glad to see you again. I'm standing beside the Singapore River. Today we will talk about There are a few smartphone apps available for checking turntable rotation speed. One popular one is called the RPM calculator. The standard stroboscope speed test discs are long regarded as the gold standard for ensuring correct splatter rotational speed of 33.3, 45 and 78 RPM. As my home uses 50Hz fluorescent lighting and we are checking for 33.3 RPM, we will be using this outer ring of white and black bars during our test. I will be using a simple screwdriver tip as a pointer to check whether the stroboscope's outer ring of white and black columns remains static or strays leftwards clockwise or rightwards anti-clockwise in relative position to the pointer. If the columns stray leftwards clockwise, it means that the platter is rotating at a speed faster than 33.3 RPM. And if the columns stray rightwards anti-clockwise, it means that the platter is rotating at a speed slower than 33.3 RPM. My smartphone weighs about 132 grams to mimic a vinyl record that typically weighs between 120 to 180 grams. Let's start the platter spinning. Here you can see the phone app registers 33.3 RPM. Now we introduce our pointer and as you focus here on the outer ring, you can see that the white and black bars are drifting leftwards clockwise. This means that the platter is rotating at a speed faster than 33.3 RPM. Thus, with all the kind intentions of the app designer, the phone app is, I'm sorry to say, is close but not entirely accurate. Next, I retune my turntable platter motor control units until I can achieve the correct speed of 33.3 RPM as according to the gold standard stroboscope disc. This would mean that the white and black bars on the stroboscope outer ring remain static in position as relative to the pointer. Let's go to part 2, start the platter spinning and we shall see now at what speed does the phone app register. The platter has got up to speed and now we introduce our pointer again. You can see that the white and black bars remain static in position as relative to the pointer. This means that the platter is rotating at exactly 33.3 RPM. As you look at the phone, the speed registered is hovering between 33.1 to 33.2 RPM. The phone app is close, but not entirely accurate. Friends, use the stroboscope speed test disc wherever possible. For me, if I just relied on my phone app to calibrate my platter speed, I would have been listening to my vinyl records at a slower speed of 33.1, 33.2 RPM, slower than what the musical performance would have been. Piano strikes would not exhibit the same good transitions, cymbal snares will not sound correct, the pitch will be wrong, the whole rhythmic drive would have been lost in translation, and I wouldn't be able to perceive the correct emotional intent of the musicians. So friends, wherever possible, use this. Thank you friends for watching and see you again. Keep the vinyl spinning.